go, Carolina. Let's go. Get that set. Let's go. Let's go, Carolina. Come on, man. Let's go. We need that pick, baby. Oh, my gosh. The Giants need this pick, man. <laughs> Giants just took an L. Let's go. Let's go. A little baby oil. Remember, every win is baby oil. You know what this baby oil represent, okay? Every time the Giants got the audacity to win a game, you might as well rub this on your ass and bend over, okay? All right, we are a game closer to Shador Sanders. If we get primetime sun up in here, he'll change the whole organization. Okay, so I got my TV on right now. Okay, the Panthers just took a one-point lead on the Saints. <laughs> Giants fans, if we could somehow get the Panthers to beat the Saints and then hold on for dear life, and lose in Germany next week, we'll have the number one overall pick. Tennessee won today. And if the Panthers win today, let's go. Listen, let me tell you something. Suck my dick to anybody who's mad that I'm happy we lost. You know there's bozos on X right now trying to tell me I'm wrong for ripping Daniel Jones. Y'all got to follow me on X if it's vicious, man. I be going off on Twitter. This dude had negative eight passing yards at half. The Giants had negative eight passing yards at the half. I would rather have Jameis Winston, who threw three picks today, because he's Jameis. I would rather deal with Jameis Winston throwing three picks than having a quarterback that is incapable of moving the ball. And if you watch the game from start to finish, Brian Dable didn't want him to throw the ball. Like, he was running, 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 running. Like it's, like, it's Madden 10 or something like that. For all my old heads out there who remember Madden 10. And Madden 10, you just ran goal line off tackle all game. And then you threw a, 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 a pass to the flats out of Snugs or something like that. That's what he was running today. He was just running with Tracy, running with Jones. We were at, like, a wing T to score a touchdown in the red zone. Like it was bad. So you can see Dable don't want Danny to be a part of the game. I feel bad for neighbors. My heart goes out to neighbors because he ain't catch a ball to the third quarter. But it's obvious Dable wants to run the ball. We have our running back of the future. Listen, I got into a car accident last week. Well, earlier this week. So I haven't been putting out content. I've been going through a lot in my personal life. This has been a real big, it's been a, it's been a strange week for me. I got into an accident. I'm okay. I'm probably going to put a video out on my Fist Vicious channel about the accident. And Derek Carr just got like a 20-yard completion. Oh, my gosh. Can this Panther team do something right? Wait a minute. Tennessee, got, Tennessee ain't win? Patriots tied the game? That's a pass interference. Yo, this Panther team ain't trying to win, bro. That's bullshit. Oh, see, that's how you tank. You see that, Giants? That's how you tank. He hit the receiver for no reason. The, the, the ball was already overthrown, and this dude just going to run over there and headbutt the receiver after the ball was already overthrown. And look at him smiling. He ain't trying to win. They ain't trying to win. I, I salute you. Shout out to the Panthers. Panthers ain't trying to win a damn thing. I receive Giants. This is how you tank. Oh, wait. It wasn't on the Panthers? Oh, shit. Hold on. There's hope. But anyway, all I'm trying to say is this. This is all I'm trying to say. If you're not going to let Daniel Jones play, Derek Carr, let's go. Let's go, Carolina. Let's go. Get that set. 
Let's go. Let's go, Carolina. Come on, man. Let's go. We need that pick, baby. Oh, my gosh. The Giants need this pick, man. Get this W, Carolina. Oh, you got to cover. Get Camara. Get Camara. Do the Panthers... We got to get this pick, fellas. I need Tennessee to beat the Patriots. I don't know how the Patriots tied the game up. Ah, come on, Carolina. Can y'all do one thing right? It's fourth and four, fellas. This, this, is the, this is Shador Sanders right here. This is the future of the Giants organization in Charlotte, North Carolina right now. We need the Panthers to win this game. Oh, my gosh, we need the Panthers to win this game, bro. And then we need to bring Andy Dalton back. We need Andy Dalton to start in Germany because he'll beat the Giants. We garbage. And Giants, are, we, we garbage. So, all I'm saying, Giants fans, is <sighs> this is our season. If you're a Giants fan, this is what Sundays are about. Sundays are about watching the Titans. The pet. Good D. No. Good D. Let's go. Woo. Yeah, boy, B. Yeah, boy. Let's that's, that's I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I love you, Derek Carr. You fucking bum. I told y'all Derek Carr trash. Derek Carr is filth. I've been telling y'all for a decade that Derek Carr is filth. You bum. Oh, my. Yo. Good D. Let's go. All right, now where is what is the score in Tennessee? All right, the Titans and Patriots and OT. All right. Um. Okay. So anyway, let me just put a bow on the Giants. All right. So I had a video that I forgot to upload about Shane and Dable being. Uh, that John Mara about a week ago, John Mara came out and said he was going to keep Shane and Dable. If y'all want me to put that video out I recorded a week ago, I'll put it out for y'all. But um, with, Jane, with Shane and Dable having job security, there's no reason we should be winning games. Now, I'm all for keeping Daniel Jones in to lose games. Let me turn the TV off, get this glare off my screen. Okay. So I'm all for keeping Daniel Jones in to lose games. But at the same time, fellas, they're running him entirely too much. Daniel Jones led this team in rushing at half. Daniel Jones led the team in rushing at halftime. We're doing way too much with Daniel Jones. He has an injury clause. This is a guy who has perennial neck injuries, shoulder issues, and a torn ACL. The last thing the Giants need to do is get this guy hurt. He had a couple of big runs today versus Washington. And then he had that, uh, I don't know what the hell Daniel Jones. So they're blaming the offensive line instead of blaming Daniel Jones. So remember in the first quarter after he had like that 24-yard run, he fumbled the ball and Washington finished the play and picked it up. Like Daniel Jones can fuck up a cup of coffee, bro. And he's got to go. I feel like if we could get Shador Sanders, we lit. That's my guy. I want primetime son because here's the thing, Giants fans. It's not just about being good. The Giants need life. This team needs a resurrection. How the Undertaker, we need to rise like the Undertaker. We need to get the yearn from Paul Bear and resurrect this franchise. That's what we need to do. Shador Sanders has that swagger. He can bring an energy to this franchise that we've never had before. I want that. And the Panthers won. If the Titans can win, the Giants is going to be in prime position to get that first overall pick, man. And that is all that matters. That's all that matters, fellas. But, uh... <clears throat> And, uh, and another thing, can we stop with the two-point convergence? I didn't talk about it last week because I was mourning the Yankees because Aaron Judge until game five was a corpse. 
So I was too pissed off at the Yankees to talk about it last Sunday versus Pittsburgh. But that dumbass two-pork conversion play last week and this dumbass two-pork conversion this week. Stop calling two-pork conversions. Wait a minute. I, never, mind, never mind. We need to lose. So keep calling them. But next season, don't do that shit. Next season, they'll be calling these bum-ass two-point conversion plays, Dable. But um, that's it. That's all, fellas. Hit the like button. Hit the sub button. Drop FUs in the comments if you rock it with me. And stay vicious. Dismiss. <laughs>